What up, peeps? We are still here in Vietnam. We The road trip has officially ended. And Jesse, we wanted to come out to the park across the street and go on these funny, go ham. these machines and get a little workout on. <laughs> Jesse, it looks so funny from the side. What do you mean? I'm working out. No, do your legs really high. <laughs> so the road trip is officially over. But it looks like we're doing a road trip extension right now. We're with the Katiki crew and Chloe and tour manager and the film guys. One Nack. And one, one half of Nack, or one quarter of Nack. We're gonna go get some more food. I'm actually kind of sick of, of Vietnamese food. I want like a cheeseburger. I really want like a cheeseburger right now, but I think we want to get Vietnamese food. Oh no, we're saying goodbye to Louie. We're rolling out, he's rolling out. He's going to LA actually. And also I want to tell you guys, if you really enjoyed our traveling videos, this man does it all the time. So if you want to see some dope travel videos, check out my man, uh, Fun for Louie. Yes. <laughs> fun for Louie. <laughs> what you don't know what just happened is my finger got caught on here and I pulled the camera out. But yeah, he travels all the time. So we're gonna have to do something crazy. Yeah, man. Crazy. Let's go somewhere nuts. You guys tell us in the comments, where do you want to see Louie and I go? And, and Gina, of course. She can come. You can come. I can come. Not, maybe. <laughs> this is it for Jackie, too, our tour manager. That was epic. Everyone let her know in the comments that she was epic. She's been reading the comments, so if you want to write something nice to her, she she'll read it. She was so nice. So she took really good care of us. So yeah, she gave us safe. So it was really nice hanging out with you and meeting you. Hopefully we'll see you on the Kentucky All-Stars. Yes. We're in our first Vietnamese taxi. So let's see what it's like to drive like a smaller vehicle in this country. We really want to drive some motorcycles. Mm -hmm. Oh, we have time tomorrow too. We have flight is until later. This is nuts. Look at the different directions. I know. I know. Look, look in front of us. Look in front of us. Oh my gosh. Look at this. Holy cow, this is so crazy. We have to get on those. <laughs> they don't seem that safe, guys. We just got to our next hotel. This one's nice. Look at this little living room. <laughs> Every time when we go on the Kentucky tours, we always stay one extra night and we get one really nice hotel room for the last of the trip just to set it off. Look at this. Check this. Wow, there's a TV in here. But what's the point of being in a tub? Unless, does this pull out? Oh, wow. totally. I'm taking a bath, called it. But it's not like they're gonna have any TV shows on it that I'd watch in <laughs> Vietnam. Where's the toilet? Where's toilet. the toilet at? It's in a separate room right here. Oh, so it's really cheap. The rooms are really cheap compared to um, America. Oh my god, there's a hiding spot. <gasps> That's so funny. There is a hiding spot. Wait, watch. Look, there's a secret door. Oh my god, what if someone came in a room in the middle of the night? Yo, that's shady. I see, I see. What are you doing? <laughs> Open it. Wait, this is unreal. Are you? This is a joke. This is a pillow menu. A me a pillow menu? Yeah. So what do you, you want to get? A, you want to get a mini compact pillow? You know, I mean, a latex <laughs> rubbery pillow. What the? You know, what I'm saying feather down pillow. Where do you get the pillow? I don't know. That is really Call, weird. Call. I want to order my pillow because this one's not good enough. It's not good enough for you. I think we stumbled across a pond of boy band, uh, Vietnamese boy band group or something. We found some people battling. Some people battling. They're battling. In this. That was super cool. We had no idea that was going on. We just walked into there and was like, what is this? It was really cool. I guess the kids out here really like breakdancing. That's what's up. The music was really good too. I liked it. Cops all over the streets. They're keeping the peace on the streets. Peace on the streets. 
I think this is for the 40th year anniversary on the photo. What I was saying before that officer told me not to film is that this is gonna this is preparation for the 40th year anniversary of when the Vietnam War ended. So they're gonna have this big parade and it looks big. This is practice for it, man. This is this is gonna be big. I would love to check this I know, parade we're out. Not gonna be here. But it's cool we get to see some of it. Like, yeah, they got all these cool floats and stuff. And this is, this city is very condensely populated so oh, I can't imagine how many people will be here. Got to get some coffee. We had the beans to get some coffee. Um, we're trying to meet up with the, the rest of the people from Kentucky that are still here in Vietnam but we don't have like we, we can't connect to them. It sucks right now. They're so cell service. Each other. But I wanted to tell um, you guys I wanted to tell you guys this whole trip pretty much every night I've been sleepwalking something crazy and Gina like the other night I just ripped all the blankets off the bed today when I took a nap I slept walk I jumped up and stormed around the I thing. didn't see that because I left the room yeah, I woke up and I was like running around the room like what am I doing <laughs> I don't know what triggers sleepwalking. Do you guys know this stress and it's, not enough sleep? You did, yeah, it? he hasn't gotten enough sleep, and you're you're like you're you're overexerting yourself. I think he's sta he's been staying up all night trying to get the vlog up, and the internet's so slow, so it's shutting off, and he's like not getting a full sleep, and he keeps waking up to try and upload. So tonight I'm gonna position the camera right near Gina, so she can maybe capture it. If it happens. So. You might call it a night because I'm not feeling too hot. I think I I either drank some of the water out here or. I don't know what it is, but it's running through me bad. Ew, <laughs> literally. But we're walking back, we're walking past the cool post office again. There it is, right there. Well, we didn't make it too far. Poor Jesse. He feels like so sick. Oh, thank God, this is the end of the trip. This is just bad, so bad, hurts. Look at the flu. I know, he's got the chills. I gave him medicine. Do you want me to help you? So we tried to go check this out, but we couldn't get a close view. And I wish I was out there right now, but Jesse doesn't feel well. This is that parade that they're, I don't know if, if this, this might be the rehearsal, but it's really cool. So we're gonna wrap up today's vlog, but I just wanted to say, please give Jesse some big support in the comments below, give him a big thumbs up, because he's been working extremely hard this whole entire road trip to make epic vlogs and edit them really well and spend a lot, a lot of time on them. So I thank him so much for that. It's been amazing seeing how great they are and um, I hope you guys enjoyed them. If you haven't seen them all, please go watch the, all of the videos because I'm sure you'll like them because it's one of our favorite things to do is travel. Tomorrow is our last day here in Vietnam. We are gonna be here for like half a day and then we go on the plane straight home to Philly and that's gonna be, oh, I think it's over 24 hours because on the way home we have an extra travel time because of the wind or something strange. I don't know, but uh, dreading that. So we'll be back home. We'll see the kitties. But yeah, this road trip was so much fun. I really enjoyed Southeast Asia. We got to see so many different places and things and the culture of everything was really cool. Um, I just love traveling and going all over the world. So if you guys enjoyed it, let us know and let us know where you might want to see us go in the future. See you guys tomorrow. I love you and peace on the streets, son. Almost says that he's going to choke me. He's trying to leave. What do I do? Uh, give it to the guy. Help me. <laughs>